A team from Underwater World will be putting on their gloves, pulling out the rubbish bags and heading out to La Polsa Park this weekend for Clean Up Australia Day. And they are inviting other Sunshine Coasters to come and join them. This Sunday we're very proud to be involved in Clean Up Australia Day and Underwater World particularly is concentrating on an area called La Bolsa Park and we'll be there from 8 till 10 in the morning with uh, rubbish bags and gloves on so come on down and please give us a hand. By being part of the annual clean up campaign Underwater World continues to raise awareness of the plight of marine animals and to recognise pollution as a key problem. We have some turtles here that have occasionally we've had to remove uh, bait bags, so fishing bait bags, uh, bits of balloon, uh, small plastic uh, bread ties, the ties that you have around your, your bread uh, bags, uh, bits of hair ties, things like that. If you have a look um, at what a plastic bag looks like in the water, it's very, very similar to a jellyfish and that's what turtles like to eat. I think uh, a lot of the people are aware now of, of where garbage ends up. It ends up eventually going down into the water, into the rivers and goes out into the ocean. So we have a large uh, pile of rubbish gathering out there and eventually it washes back onto our shores. Almost 300,000 volunteers turned out to the first Clean Up Australia Day in 1980. And that involvement has steadily increased ever since, with millions of Australians volunteering over the 23 years and removing over 272,000 tonnes of rubbish. If you're down the beach and you walk past some rubbish, please pick it up. Uh, it's bound to help an animal out and it, it makes the beaches look better. To register or find out more information, please visit the websites.